It is game five of the Western Conference Final, which is now a best two out of three series. This is a crucial game five. Who's going to win? The Edmonton Oilers or the Dallas Stars? We'll be right back with a breakdown of this game. But first, if this is your first time watching Wager Talk TV, please hit that subscribe button. It just takes a second to do so. It helps us to bring you all this free content in all sports uh, from Wager Talk TV. So uh, hit that subscribe button. We would muchly appreciate it. Right now on the Wager Talk live odds board, it has Dallas as a minus 130 favorite and a total of six under 20. We'll start with the total here as uh, we now have had two games going over and two games gone under. Uh, at six again, I do lean to the under, but we have not bet one total in this series. And truthfully, we're not going to plan on doing it tonight. Uh, but for anyone that wants to bet the total in here, I just w wanted to put it out there. Both games in Edmonton were overs. Both games in Dallas, 3-2 double overtime, 3-1 both unders. So just giving you something to think about. You might want to look. If you like Edmonton for the game, you might like to bet it over. If you like Dallas for the game, you might bet it under. That seems to be the a correlation. But, again, we will pass the total. As for the side, we've already put this out as a best bet to our clients, and our play is going to be on the Dallas Stars tonight. There's no denying that Edmonton have had played a great, great series. Their special teams have been unbelievable, and they still can be the key for them to win this series. Uh, I just like Dallas here. Mind you, if Tanif doesn't play tonight, that might be a problem for him. Of course, they're going to keep that right to a game time decision. Whether he plays or not, doesn't want they don't want Edmonton to know what's going on. Uh, but again, we really do like Dallas here in this one. And for starters, it's a reason why I've mentioned a few times on these videos. Dallas, to me, still has not played their best game. Maybe that's a product of Edmonton being playing so well, but they just have not played their best game. Uh, I like the fact that the board gets last uh, change here. I think it's going to help big time, especially now that he has hints back in the lineup. That's going to be key, especially with now he has a few games under his belt. So we do like DeBoer having that last change. Uh, and Dallas has really held Edmonton to long periods of time defensively without Edmonton getting a shot on goal at all. So that, there's something to that in here. But uh, I'm going to try to do my best Peter DeBoer on how he's going to maybe get – put some fire under this club. So I figured the guys come in after pre, uh, you know, after the warmups, uh, pregame. And when they walk in, they have, all they see on the whiteboard is 79%. The bore then goes into, if they, these guys already don't know, NHL teams in game five who win game five have won 79% of this series in NHL history. So he explains this to the boys, and then here's what he says. Okay, guys, our leaders, Pavalski, Duchesne, no more screwing around. It's time to take over. It's time to be that leader. Jake, man, I love you, man. You're the best. You played like dog shit in Edmonton for those two games. I know, and you know, you're going to have your best game of this series, and you're going to help us win this game. Defense, you need to be a little bit better and shut down these guys. Can't have these big guns like McDavid and Dreisaitl scoring any goals win this game for them. And to a man, I want you to remember, 79%. Every time you go out on that ice, 79%. We are going to be the 79% tonight. And you just keep telling yourself, we are going to win. We're going to be the 79% and get out there and win. That's my little Peter DeBoer before the game. Uh, also, one thing, other thing I like about uh, Dallas here is your experience. They were in the conference final last year. DeBoer has been to two Stanley Cups. 
He's lost them, but he's been to two. So that experience could help down, down the road, especially in a two out of three. So for me, Dallas is the play here. Now head over to wagertalk.com where for today only until midnight, we have a fill up your cart special, 25% off everything on the site. So that's three day, seven day, 30 day, any yearly, yearly package you want to get from all the wager talk cappers. And for us, take advantage as the CFL starts next Thursday. And you can take 25% off our yearly package, which brings it down to a ridiculous $225. Number one in CFL lifetime at Wager Talk plus 138 units. If you're betting CFL this year, grab that package. It's a great deal. As always, stay right tuned here. There's going to be a, another free content video from Wager Talk TV again. Hit that like button. Subscribe to Wager Talk TV. Best of luck with all your plays all weekend. And as always, have a great day.